everybody. Welcome back to Divinity Original Sin, the Enhanced Edition. It's very noisy here again. I do believe it is time that we started the action between the Mountain Men and the Orcs. They're all, they're all drunk now, as you can see, they've all got all the little circles around the heads, some of them. So let's have a talk to the uh, Jarl. May your sword never sully, and your shield never shatter. Okay, I have proof that it was Orcs who killed Garrick. I knew it. I felt in my heart that Garrick was dead. But we'll honour his memory in blood. By our you cobbled slinger, so we will. The horn you found proves the thief and the murderer is an orc. I need no further incentive. The wolves howl and the bears growl. I'm coming for you, Grutilda. And you. You have shown you are a friend of the mountains. Join me. Together we'll undo every last orc in Hunter's Edge. The battle has begun. Okay, here we go. The log updated. Where's he going? Brothers of Tanarath. Let's see Blood that brothers of Jarl. The orcs have betrayed our alliance. And so we show them the meaning of the mountain's might. Oh, I'm tripping. Rutilda! Come out here, you beast, and face me. By the mace of Barhan Skullgrinder, you'll heed my call. We're going to stay back Rutilda! here. Come on, Grutilda, here she comes. Oh, she's drunk as well. Well, that's good. Grutilda, face me, you she-devil. I know you stole our bloodstones. I know one of your dogs spilled a proud mountain son's blood. And I have the proof to back it up. Ah, Jarl, chief of the snow-clad peaks and conqueror of worlds, hereby sentence you to death. My blood brother's demise will not go unavenged. <laughs> oh, y'all, do calm yourself. You're positively hysterical. Now, we both know this moment was meant to come. You didn't think I, an all mother, would bow to some witch calling herself the conduit to the goddess, did you? Gullible little ape, aren't you? The so-called conduit was only as useful as her little tricks with bloodstone and tenebrium. After that, it only made sense to gather the stuff alongside, rather than against her immaculates. But now, all that is over. Would you like to see what's become of your precious bloodstones, Jarl? Have a look. Ooh! And the Jarl is down. Here we go. Fight. Who's hitting me then? <laughs> Alright, we've got a fight behind us. We'll leave that one alone. Fight there. Can we get her? No, 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 no. We are going to do that. And we're going to move forward a little bit. And we are going to prepare. I suppose I could use that. No, not yet. Need them all together. Right, and turn there. Okay, there's another one down. We're not doing well here. <laughs> Who are we on here now? Right, we'll 
get that up. That should help. And save your points. Tension there. Let's try it. Nice one. I certainly wouldn't like to start this fight by fighting both of these. That would be uh, a challenge in a high. You'd have to be a few levels higher than this, I think. Okay. do with you? How many points need for that? 11 to use. Need two more, so let's save your points. Oh, she resurrected him. <laughs> Target. Target's blocked. Right, well, let's move you out to there then. Now then. Very nice. Very nice. One, two, three of those it took down then. That is what I like to see. Um. Oh, always engage those orcs yet. Alright, we'll save his points then. Come on, good shoulder. Get one of these and our men. I know just the cure. Okay, that seems to have not faded quick enough. Right. The combat music's gone. We should be able to reap quite a bit of experience from uh, these fights, I'm hoping. heal herself. Back to nearly three quarters there. Right, can you see her now? Yes. Flurry. We're 
the shot. I feel better already. All right, let's move you over here. See if we can engage these, shall we? I think Gratilla's going down this turn. Yes, there she goes. 10k experience. Very nice. Right, come on, boys. A stitch in time, eh, my friends? On my feet again. Get Dora in front. Should we get a ricochet off here, I think? Yes. Finish that. No glory in this death. Four shots he's getting off. Good grief. That's nice. As good as a new penny. Uh right, okay. As good as a new penny. I don't think he's going to last too long, is he? No, he's not. And we get the experience for it. Yes, come on, boys. Charm failed. Of course it did. Let's curse him instead then. All right. Where are you going? Easy experience.
They're doing a grand job, these mountain men, I must admit. Starting to feel a little bit sorry for the orcs. Come on, boys, give me a turn. No, I'm not going to get a go, I don't think. No. Right, back this way. Uh, you pull that on yourself, please. Thank you. In some more up here, then. Yes, there we are. We'll fight up here. Come on, boys. Oh, God, look at them all. <laughs> oh, dear. Poor Orcs. Pressing the wrong button then. Let's go back to the Knight's Temple as well. There's orcs there, so I'm, I'm taking they aren't dead yet. I'll go there after this one. To reap some more experience. Wow. Here-ish. Actually, get to fight this turn. Why are you all moving so fast? Oh, a mass slow.
All right, who we got here? All right, let's throw a little heal on Wargraf. That will do for Scarlet. Cripple. Oh, look at that. Got the decapitator down as a distraction. I'll do nicely. Rather him take the damage than me. <laughs> Adios. Oh, let's get a taunt in. Nearly killed him. Ah, uh, yeah. Ooh. Another one down. And another one. Yeah. Uh, was that the last of them? Too bad. I was just starting to find my rhythm. Don't despair. This battle may be over, but the war rages on. Right, let's have a quick word with Richard. The, the day pain. is ours, and by the fists of hot or granite flesh, what a victory this is. We have overcome even the might of bloodstones unleashed, which will, I believe, both please and fear the blessed conduit. But don't think I didn't notice your prowess in battle either. It's good to have you on our side. You have the brothers of Tanaros undying respect. Okay, thank you. Take my leave. As shall we. The conduit will want these stones refilled with human blood. Back in the direction of the mountains we'll go and seek for fresh hamlets to plunder. Oh dear. Off we go, sons of the peaks. And you, Immaculate, blessings of a Canto Druid born be upon thee. Thank you, I think. Oh, look at that. I just got a text. That's unusual. Let me just check what that was. Right. What have we got here? We got a key. All right, let the looting begin. So we need to all the way back. I think.
think there should be some loot around this area here. A little bit of luck. Well, there must be inside. Ah, there we go. Look at all this wonderful stuff. Let's get all this. Tell you what we'll do while we're here. I'm Strike not going to pick up all this loot on camera. I'm going to do all that off camera, I think. But what we will do while I think on We'll nip into this little house here, shall we? Where is there to loot? Painting the landscape, all of that and that. Priestess Cordelia's diary. Let's have a look at that. Which I never saw. I never, never saw her get killed or kill her. Read. This is all very interesting. A woman and her husband, they hardly fought at all. And all the better for me, once they were dead, I found a lovely little spell to use on their corpses. An ancient immaculate incantation, and most useful one at that. It will prove even cold corpses could be turned towards the greater good. The conduit would be extremely pleased. The method is simple. A totem of bone, which I bought off her before we, we, she disappeared. Whoop. What happened there? I must tell the priestess within the mine that the guard had taught them well. Oh, I hope it's not that totem that we need, the one that was in the mine, because I destroyed it in this playthrough. Why does it keep doing that? <laughs> All right. Log updated. Aren't those the skeleton traders we met? Charla in Sicile and Horton just outside this village? If this is to be believed, their spirits are trapped in a dark priestess's totem. Yep, they certainly are. And we, I think, might get the chance... Oh, there's a bottle of swirling mud. Now this is valuable. Ooh. Take some of this. Don't need it all. Right. Let's head down. Pumpkin bread, bottle of wine, honey. Ooh, that's not nice. What have we got here? I need Avatar out of fire. I could move these and put them in front of there. It does help a little bit, I suppose. We can't do it with him, though. Um, how long does it last the other time? Not long enough. Come on, make a run for it. There we go. What have we got along the edges here? Anything of any interest? Look at all, these, all this stuff that you could get for crafting. Right. 
right, antique silver ring, we'll take that. Wonderful plate belt, we'll have that. Painted of a woman, yes please. Oh, nearly missed that chest then. Single handed telekinesis, we'll keep that on Roderick, because he has telekinesis. Say that. Cool graph. I can't see anything of interest there, can you? Now then. Has she gone? Oh, there it is. Get in there. There we go. Small born totem. <laughs> I am returned to my true home. Yes, the magic of the mark flows through me, and know their souls, how they wail. Uh, you can speak, but how? Tell me about the priestess who crafted you. Cordelia, mother of lives and deaths. She found the ancient spell that would give me life. The spell that would consign those souls to me. And her work grows and thrives. Brothers and sisters alike to me in function. But double, triple, one hundred times in capacity are being born across Riverland. A new order is forming. No longer will souls waste their power in the Hall of Echoes. Let them better serve as food for a new species. Tell me about the souls you harbour. <sighs> Tara and her husband Hortum. Their souls call out to one another, but they are blinded by the curse upon them. Their confusion is an elixir I sip from at my leisure. Their bones wander the earth as tradesmen. Content enough, their fate is not one to be mourned. They serve a purpose. Their corpses perform a function, do they not? And their souls give me delicious, agonizingly delicious life. Okay, I made a choice about the souls trapped within you. A decision is not yours to make. Their souls are mine, gifted to me by the priestess. You cannot take them from me. You cannot have them. Uh, if we free them, their torment will end. They'll be reunited after being so terribly abused. Let this evil weave its magic no more. Take them if you wish. There will be more. There will always be more. My kind will grow in ranks, and yours will serve only to sate us. Horton! Is that you? Charlotte, darling, 
I'm here! Gods, after searching for so long! I didn't think I'd ever find you! All was darkness! All was chaos! Never again! May we never part again, my love! And there we have it. We have freed Charlotte and Horton. That's good. A good day's work, that. I was starting to doubt that I would be able to do it since I've destroyed the bone totem in, uh, in the mines. Oh, what's that? It's like, let's have a look. But it appears we can do it with the one that we get off her, so that is good. Right, I'm quite pleased with that. So now the uh, Charla, who is the merchant outside Sizeal, is now How dead. We can go back there and pick up uh, all her goodies. And I'll just show you while we're in here that we can do the same, if I can find it. We can do the same with our friend Horton, who was here trying to sell us uh, items. He should be uh, gone now, and all his stuff should be on the floor. And I think that will be the end. Of Hunter's Edge, we have completed it. I'm warm as fresh apple pie. Yep, here we go. Let's have a look. Oh yes, look at that. All that stuff there. He's dropped for us very kindly, which I will pick up and deal with off camera. So thanks very much for watching, folks. Uh, don't forget if you do like the videos, leave me a like and subscribe. This is All Grey signing off.